Hello everybody and welcome back to the Rock and Reaction Rollers where we react to music that we grew up with from the 60s to the 90s and my name is Tammy. Uh, we're doing your guys' request but I'm only going to get two out tonight. Still very busy with everybody sick around me here and I'm just hoping and praying I don't get it because I got to go back to work tomorrow and so I got to make sure I'm well. So anyway, hopefully uh, it passes me on by. I've been doing a lot of washing my hands today and trying to stay away from it all but tomorrow's Chuck's birthday and poor guy he just uh <laughs> he just is not feeling good so anyway I'm gonna get two songs out and we're just gonna get started with them and the first one we're gonna do is a request for Karen and um, she wants to hear the 1974 Steely Dan tune called Ricky Don't Lose That Number and so um, I just wanted to read a little bit about Steely Dan and we have other songs of theirs on the channel so some of the stuff is kind of repeated um, but you know people forget or you know they may not have seen the other video so I just read it again but Steely Dan is an American rock band founded in 1971 in New York by Walter Becker which is the guitar he plays the guitars bass and ba backing vocals and Donald Fagan, who plays the keyboards and is the lead vocal. Becker and Fa Fagan played together in a variety of bands from their time together, studying at Bard College in Annandale on Hudson, New York. They later moved to L.A., gathered a bunch of band members, musicians, and began recording albums. So that's kind of how they got started, and so again, we're just going to get right to it. This is a request for my girl Karen out there. She wants to hear the 1974 Ricky Don't Lose That Number by Steely Dan. Stop this song for a minute. <laughs> oh, 
it's been a while since I've heard this old tune and I always liked it. It's just one that just kind of sticks there in your head and, and one of my favorite Steely Dan tunes. Um, so um, thanks for the request, Karen. And we're just going to get right back to it so we can hear the rest of this great tune. We're doing the 1974 Ricky Don't Lose That Number by Steely Dan. I was what 12 years old <clears throat> so I don't really know what I ever thought the song was about or anything like that it's just um, I thought Ricky was a guy and I thought maybe it was his brother or something and he's telling him here's your phone number or here's my phone number make sure you keep it on yet <laughs> but actually I think Ricky was a woman and there are a couple stories out there about what the song's about a couple different women thinking that they're talking about them and so I don't think they confirmed that it was either one of them, but let's see what they do have to say about the song here. It says, this song was taken from the song called For My Father, which was released in 1964 by the jazz composer and pianist Horace Silver. The opening of both songs is nearly identical. It's a good example of how Steely Dan used elements of jazz in their songs. So I have to go check that out. Again, the name of that song is For My Father. So kind of coincidental too that um, yesterday was Father's Day that that kind of come up. So <laughs> stuff like that happens all the time to me when I'm reading this stuff. It's interesting, but okay. And it says this song was Steely Dan's highest charting single, reaching number four on the Hot 100 in 1974. The B-side to this song was Any Major Dude Will Tell You and we have that song on the channel too so you have to go check it out and then it just says on here too Jeff Jeff Baxter which I guess they called him Skunk um, <laughs> plays the guitar solo on this song and he later went on to join the Doobie Brothers so just a little bit of information there about Jeff Skunk Baxter <laughs> anyway that's about all I got Steely Dan's got so much information out there about them and they're interesting to read about so if you ever get time extra time and and you're interested in them just go check it out and um, I can just put little bits and pieces of things that you know I see out there that are interesting about the song or whatever and so I'm just giving you guys the bare bones to so if it's something that you want to elaborate on you can always go out there and look it up and read more about it so anyway um, I'm going to try to put one more, or I'm going to put one more song out, and then I'm going to hit the hay. It's just been uh, a world of sickness the last couple of days, and uh, poor Chuck announced his birthday like he needs us on top of it, and I'm just exhausted to tell the truth, so um, we are going to get one more out. I'm sorry about that, but that's all I'm going to make it to, so uh, 
Be sure to tell those people that you love that you love them each and every day. And be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And be sure to hit like underneath the video. That's real important. So while you click on the video and you're listening to it, just hit like. Because that pushes the, the uh, videos out into the algorithm. So anyway, we're going to go for now. Peace out.